Thank Welcome you. to Brookfield Village. Should we take off our shoes? Absolutely, oh, yes. Okay. Yeah. Yep. I mean, you live here and uh, it's amazing. I mean, do you, what do you feel about the current development that's going on? It's, they're still building. They are still building. Um, as you came in through the, um, I think it was um, from uh, Main Street, you know, there's a new construction going on by uh, Stonebridge Builders and they're putting, putting up an additional 80, 80 more homes. Oh, okay. Single family homes like this. Mm -hmm. um, and right behind me is an, is an, is an elder home. They're putting up an, an additional, I would say about 500 homes. Okay, is it for like 50 or plus? Yep, okay. 55 plus I believe. Okay, got it. From what I understand, so I don't think anything's changed since then. So you're, but, you're yeah. in like the middle of the action, like lots, there was lots of different development going on around here. Yep. What, yep. How is it like being a, a resident? I mean, what, can you tell me a little bit more about the amenities? Oh, I, is, there, is there like a walking path over there? There's a walking path, there's a hiking trail right behind me, um, the rendition um, at Union Point, well, Union Point South Weymouth is they're going to have at least a couple of thousand, um, maybe, actually not a couple of thousand, but 200, 200 miles of like, of hiking, hiking mm -hmm. paths, of walking. Just okay. this whole old um, Weymouth Air, Air Force Base. So it's going to be phenomenal. I bet it's good for the summer, like once yeah. the snow melts and yep. everything to go outside. Yeah, yeah, I heard a lot about kind of that buzz where a smart city uh, yep. you know, at Union Point. Yep. What is that like? Do is there a lot of like solar panels going on? There, um, it's it's solar panels mm -hmm. as well as um, um, what they're trying to create here is a like what you're saying a smart city where they're gonna have um, heated sidewalks, um, oh, okay. self-driving cars here. It's gonna be and the train station is about five minutes. It's about a five ten minute walk, mm -hmm. South Weymouth train station. So mm -hmm. um, we already have those self-driving cars and in the area so if oh, you wow. need, yeah it's that's um that's that's what they're trying trying to do here so we've already have i think they've already established some of what they're doing but um so do they have like a you know a shuttle that's going around to different uh, you know, small cars you if yeah uh, once you, once you, if you take a drive around the community you might actually see those cars uh -huh. um but so there is there is a person just for this community yep yeah oh, so there okay. are i think two or three cars that kind of pick people up at the train station and take them back to their homes. Oh, wow. And or, it's all free. It's all um, I'm, I, I haven't used it, so I don't know if it's free. Okay. Um, may, maybe like a small small fee. Uh -huh. But they'll also pick you up at your home and take you to the train station. Oh, that's nice. Which is pretty Yeah. Yeah, instead of walking good. in the snow. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Um, so. so in this, as we're driving around, there are townhouses, there are condos, and there are single family. Yep. What makes you choose this, this particular one? Single family. Um, we're a little particular about the home that we chose, but we got lucky with this place. I mean, we're facing west, um, a lot of sun. Mm -hmm. So the house, you know, the sun sets. This is west, and, you know, I can, I can open my front door, and there's sunlight in this in this living room. Uh huh. I love it. Yeah, it is. And I can see it. I can tell. Definitely. Lots of larger windows and higher ceilings yeah. too, so which is yeah. nice. Very common with the new construction. And yeah, yeah. and one I mean we have a walkout basement yeah. which is very uncommon in this in this development. Yeah. There's only three homes with walkout basements and we're we were lucky enough to yeah. have right. and I also saw there's a lot of retail stores that are opening up too. Yep, they're coming. Yep. It's taken some time but um They'll, they'll be here. Yeah, that's exciting. So yeah. everything is walkable. Um, everything, you know, yeah, you know, walkable, bikeable, right. um, whatever the future brings us. Okay, awesome. Yeah. Well, um, that's, yeah, it's really exciting, you know, coming here and see this little uh, neighborhood that starts to grow. And uh, I, I know that you're also a loan officer at Wells Fargo. Mm -hmm. So um, you're familiar with the lending uh, yes. situation here as well. Yes. Can you tell us a little bit more <clears> about <throat> that? Um, well, Wells Fargo definitely has the best jumbo, jumbo loan programs nationally um i mean i i work with our internal team for this house and my loan is through wells fargo and you know no issues here any words for future buyers here you know who are future residents in the community anything you wanted to tell them about um you know always i mean when you're looking to buy a property always reach out to christy you know <laughs> christy's the best here in boston and um get yourself pre-approved mm -hmm. if if not pre-approved then get yourself credit approved meaning that you know we can um have another right to look at your look at your loan get you fully approved and you know make the um make the purchase that much faster yeah my 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 fastest close was eight days oh wow eight days eight days yeah. from start to finish 
Well, I think that's great. So, I mean, you know, knowing that you live here as a resident and uh, you know, you're know you familiar with the lending side and anything about the, this association yep. makes uh, the loan a lot faster too, yep. I'm sure. Absolutely. So great. And then you know we're, we're excited to check out other styles as well. So we're going to be driving around and check out some other places. Thank you.